If you look at a quaking bog, it's something that grows away from the shore, grows out into open water, and the, there are certain types of plants which go out first, which are little guys, and then there are bigger plants that grow after them, and bigger ones and bigger mm -hmm. ones, and they get thicker and thicker layer of peat there that they're growing on. We continued that walk from there as we went out towards the center of what I didn't know at that time was actually a lake. Uh -huh. It got thinner and thinner, so you didn't need the whole group. You Did could you, uh, individually, you could create mm -hmm. these waves. Get a little bit further and you realize each, each step was pressing the yeah. ground down. It's like, uh, That'd be weird. I'm a little, yeah. I'm a little concerned about right. this. Yeah. And I realized at some point, this is a little too mushy. I'm a bipedal organism. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's you good for me to, to be in this yeah. position. So I got on right. my hands and knees to spread my weight out. And, and even my elbows are, mo I get out further and we've, the trees are gone, and now we're talking about shorter bushes, mm -hmm. tall bush cranberries. Mm -hmm. Then we got into short bush cranberries and, and blueberries and this sort of thing. By now, I am, I am flat on, I'm afraid I'm gonna go through and yeah. you know I could never find my way back up. Eventually I got to where I'm not gonna go any further. This is getting thinner. Open water out there. This is something that grows out over water, small plants to large plants. Mm -hmm. And you can actually float entire forest. 